When you scream gold, I don't care what color, race, or creed you are, you run. And everybody runs towards it. So you had boats coming. You had the English, the French, the Chinese, the Portuguese, Spanish. People coming from the East Coast via covered wagon and they tried to get over Donner Pass. They stopped, ate their grandparents and their kids, and then went down the hill into town. They brought with them their food and their culture and their lifestyle. The city's almost forgotten about its own history. And for me, that is what this city is all about. The inspiration I get from San Francisco, I mean, the first two things that come to mind are the topography and the light, the quality of the light here. If you get on a bike anywhere in the city, you can't help but notice it. It's not flat whatsoever. And it makes for these amazing little microclimates. The weather is all over the place. You know, it can be sunny one minute and then you get to the other side of the city and you're in thick fog and you're freezing. The city's small. It's the peninsula, it's seven by seven. So there are no dead spaces in San Francisco. There's no lulls anywhere. You'll hit a wall where you just, within the course of one block, you're in a radically new place, and a radically new neighborhood. And that's what's fun. Like, there's stuff everywhere. There's all these little nooks and crannies. You know, you ride from downtown towards the park, and then all of a sudden, you can find an hour of trails to ride on. Have you ever heard of the Anchor Steam Ride? You could do like 50 miles all off-road in the city. To the south of the Golden Gate Bridge, you have this amazing kind of metropolis, and then you are on the bridge for five minutes, and you get off, and you're in just complete and untouched wilderness. Definitely got to know the city best on a bike. When you're in a car, I don't think you take the time to notice it as much. I think things just kind of blur together. I think SF is definitely best understood through bicycle. I mean, you have the wiggle. You have a whole thing where people set up a way to not have to climb one hill. You have all this education that's right in front of you, and it's what you make out of it. Do you want to take it for granted, or do you want to suck it all up? <laughs>